Today's word is ladder. Ladder. L A D D E R. Ladder. Ladder. Today's word. I think we should just make a clip vlog of randomness. I can think of nothing else to do. I'm bored. I'm bored of myself. Let's see what's going on on Facebook today. David Winston Lee. By London, it's been fun. Rhys Lloyd Bowen Jones. I might know his mother. Weirdest discussion of the year so far where a student asked me, do you believe in the Illuminati? God love the French. I wanna go to France. If anyone can send me to France, please let me know. Kirsty Taylor, I want glow in the dark shoes. Colon closed bracket. No, open bracket. You know what I mean. And there's a couple of pictures of silly things. Actually, that's what we're gonna talk about today. Why is it? that Facebook feels the need to fill itself with inane trite drivel that just seems to circulate around the entire globe in the space of a day only to then be forgotten as if it never started in the first place. Nearly swore refrain. <laughs> Seriously, all it is is just people posting pictures of cats in hats and I'm looking at you Jessica Peters because you do this. What else goes around? Oh my gosh, there's people where it's like like for this or share for that when they specifically bias it towards the person that they like by putting them in the like category because it's much easier to click like than it is to click share and then click are you sure you want to share and you go yes and he goes because if you post it we can't take it down he goes I want to share I've made up my mind he goes you sure because you are committed to a lifelong term here you go yes please just share the damn thing for me so it's much easier to say oh I like Justin Bieber than it is to share Oscar Wilde's picture of Dorian Gray which is a classic literary piece of pure genius Yes. But no, because we're focusing on Harry Styles' cute smile and fluffy afro in today's Heat magazine or something ridiculous like that. I feel like David Mitchell, damn it! Ow, I just hurt my leg. There's nothing wrong with feeling like David Mitchell. He's a very attractive young man. Who's married? Or getting married? Is he really to who? Yeah. I'm gonna look this up. David Mitchell. You know, David Mitchell's middle names are James and Stuart and that he was born on the 14th of July, 1974. And he's part Welsh as well, isn't he? Is he? Yeah. In December 2010, he started dating the broadcaster Victoria Corrin. Oh. Am I saying that right? Corrin? In March 2012, their engagement was announced in the Times. Who is this Victoria Corrin? She is an English writer, presenter, and champion poker player. That's oh. interesting. Yeah. Corrin writes weekly for The Observer and The Guardian and she was born on the 18th of August, 1973. That's all we have time for today. Thanks for joining us. If you've liked today's clip vlog, then you might want to see a psychiatrist. If you want to contact us, then you can contact us on my face. I want to see how Gareth does that. Right, thank you. Goodbye. Biscuit.